All praises to Haya Shora Haya, Bashem Yishaya, Walk on Ash Walk. This is Shabari Israel, and today I would like to speak about a prophetic dream that the Most High has shown me as of recently concerning his priest. I appeared in a room, and the room was illuminated with such brightness. And there was a man there in front of me, and he was making accusations against me. And then all of a sudden, Another male appeared behind me. He was dressed in all white, and his hair was white as snow. His appearance was like that a brown brass, and the accusations that the man was making, he was telling the male that I was a priest. So the male stated, she is not a priest, but a power. Then he handed me two objects that were in his hand. And then it ended. I received wisdom, instruction, and understanding concerning this. The man there that was making the accusations represented the priest of the Most High, the tribe of Levi. And it was time for the judgment from the Most High. And also your so-called pastors, the so-called uh, leaders of the flock, if you will. He was trying to throw me in there with them because of the judgment. Because preacher only means public speaker. In the Hebrew, but no, the Most High said, "No, I have made her a power." And what does power mean in the Hebrew? It means a ruling authority. You see that a force to be reckoned with. The tribe of Gad and the male in the all white and with the white hair, I recognize his voice was none other than God Himself. Haya Shara Haya. I had been going through something, and and I was missing two objects right here in real time. And I knew within that the Most High was testing me and putting me under a trial. And likewise, he proved this by coming to me in spirit and showing me these things. You see that? He gave me the two objects back. And I used faith. I walked by faith and not by sight. And he's telling me, I am going to return what you have lost, tribe of Gad. You see that? And he has done so with those two objects and will continue to do so in the near future. I mean, right, literally right around the corner. So this is the conclusion of the matter. He has made the tribe of Gad, Shabar, Yashar, Allah, 49, 19, a ruling power and authority in his eyes and government. And it's time for the judgment on your pastor, your preacher, your false prophet, your captains on the corner, camp, Hebrew camps, Christians. False prophetess, wizards that peep in and out, men and women. All religions, you see that, that calls themselves a ruling government authority on the face of the earth. Because you will not throw Shabbat, Yasharala head first in the lake of fire. As we can see the volcanoes are erupting from the ground. For I will not and have not crucified his only son afresh who has become the high priest. After the order of Melchizedek and dominion, <laughs> government and authority will be on his shoulders and belong to him. Jude 125. So those who have an ear, let them hear what the Spirit is saying.